Back in December, the Book of Me Hangout looked at three prompts that were going to be covered in the first part of 2014. Well, the last of those prompts was memory board. Whether memory board was something that you liked to have, whether you thought it was a good idea, uh, and if it was, what you would include on it. Um, and I envisaged a pin board where you would put things on. That was kind of my, my vision. However, I came away and thought as we approach this week's prompt, because this prompt is the one that will be released tomorrow, so on Saturday the 1st of February, um, I thought I'd have a quick look at pulling together a memory board, almost um, a bullet pointing session of what I would include on a memory board, which might look at the particular part of my working life. So the one I've chosen to cover is my pharmacy profession. So I've worked in pharmacy for more than 20 years. Um, this is going to chart my professional journey. So it's going to look at my initial training, um, where I did my training, the people that I met there. It's then going to look at the drug developments that have happened during that period of time. So the, the discoveries, the drug trials and discoveries that have enabled drugs to come onto the market and to be available and the drugs that have perhaps been withdrawn from the market and therefore are no longer available. It's going to look at the events and conferences that I've attended um, and that where I've attended and given a presentation. It will look at the places that I've worked, so community pharmacy, hospital, industrial pharmacy, which I found rather boring, and I worked for the prison service for, for a while. Um, it looks at the people that I met along the way, so the colleagues, the patients and other healthcare professionals. Now, clearly, I won't be in the habit of remembering patients' names, but you know, because of confidentiality, but I must have looked after and spoken to millions of people in the last 20 odd years. So it's not necessarily the people that you remember, it's the scenario that you remember. It's the discussion that you had or the emotional link that you felt with the patient whilst retaining that professional boundary. Um, then I've also been going to look at the people that make the job worthwhile. They're the people that I've worked alongside and enjoyed working alongside and perhaps enjoyed working with them so much it perhaps kept me in a job that I should have left before I actually did um, and I think we've all got a little thing there that will most people will recognize that that it's the people that you meet along the way that enable the job to be as good as it is um, any regrets I may have um, I do have some professional regrets um, and they may well come out in my when I create my memory board. And then to come back almost to do a full circle is that we then have to do CPD, so professional development, which enables us as professionals to continue working and continue being of a good standard and having a good understanding and knowledge of the field that we work in. And perhaps look to where we want to go within our our profession and whether we perhaps deviate from it. Um, so that is a really quick synopsis around how I view this particular memory board but a memory board can be of all sorts of things. It could be about a particular job that you had, it could be about um, one of your children or your grandchildren or it could have been about a, a, tra a holiday or it could be about anything. I've just very, very quickly pulled together this as an example for you um, because a memory board does not necessarily have to be in the physical sense. It could be in the digital sense. So for this will probably be in the digital sense because there are some images and things that I want to use to illustrate it. And those images are, of course, online. And obviously I've got pictures and things. Um, so I think it's a good way of exploring and almost, if you like, a prompt within a prompt. So that covers it for this week. I'm hoping that you will have found this short presentation and what we covered in the Hangout on the 10th of December um, of, useful, um, of su useful support in which to create your memory board or even have a think about it. Um, and I hope to be back very, very soon with some Hangouts. As you may well know, the Hangouts have stopped momentarily just while my mum is so poorly. Um, and I'm hoping very soon that we can resume our usual schedule. Thank you for listening and I hope this has been useful to you and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.